Alright guys, it is your boy Ryan Thomas here. I'm going to slowly move this over so you don't notice uh, that I didn't even get this in frame. Here's the G7X <laughs> that we reviewed it or unboxed in the last video. I'm going to put that down there. I'm also going to grab... Where did it go? Where did it go? This video is pretty much uh, thanks by SLR, thanks to SLR Hut for sending over these cool battery banks. Thank you Joseph at SLR Hut. And um, that's really cool. We've got our Sigma... Uh, we got a Metaphone Speed Booster. Our Sigma uh, 18 to 35 f 1.8 and our Panasonic GH4. Gonna start off with the meta bones and slowly build ourselves up, I think, Morgan. Let me just make yep. sure you got a good, yeah, you got a good frame. I, I'm gonna give you, don't worry about it. Um, so we've got our meta bone speed booster here. This is what's gonna enable us to put the Sigma onto the GH4. Now, what I've heard from this is this actually steps your uh, aperture down another stop. So technically, this is an f0.8 lens. Um, <laughs> On our camera, <laughs> not sure if that's real, but uh, it says it online. It says it in the description, so there you go. Um, so we're just gonna bring this. I, do, I don't want to rip the packaging. Um, this is cool because it's an adapter, right? It's a powered adapter, but you get it in this cool little plastic case. Oh, I like that. Which is which is pretty awesome. So I'm gonna just put the box off to the side there. So here it is. It says Meta Bones. Um, this costs. F uh, in fact, I'm gonna bleep that out because. That's a lot of money, and I'm not gonna tell you guys how much it's worth. So <laughs> this costs a lot of money. Uh, we've got that is a hefty bit of kit. Got the obviously where the lens goes in the front, and that's the micro four thirds mount. So this is Canon lens for a micro four thirds mount camera. That's all you get. That's it, guys. You get this sponge bit to put it in. I'm just gonna put it in here. Uh, that was the unboxing of the Metabone Speed Booster. If you guys want to see, <laughs> that's it. Uh, you also get two little Allen keys and what looks like some bit. Hang on, let me just take this out. Get some gubbins in here for like extra little dots or buttons. I guess you want to put on it. Uh, and I'm guessing that is all to do with uh, like the changing of the the mounts and stuff or whatever. So that's cool. That looks like that. Yeah, that has some dials on it. I'm not sure what that's for, but let's leave that in there for now. So let's stick that there so you guys can still see it. Here's the Sigma 1835F 1.8. This is cool. Like, this is like an Apple-esque box. It's very, like, simple. So you get a little, like, guide here, health and safety. Nope, that's warranty. That's a warranty. Um, wow. Get another, like, quick start guide in like, a billion different languages. Uh, warranty sticker. Uh, and then, you're never going to guess about this, a lens that comes in a small bag. We're going to have so many of these. Every, everything here. comes in bags, so. though. Everything does. So you unzip it, it says Sigma on the front in like metal. Oh. Which is like rubber. <laughs> There's some foam and like padding on this. Oh my god. Okay. You get. How heavy you is You get that? a lens hood. Goes on the end. Didn't know you had that. I'm using that. Just to look <laughs> more professional. So you get our bag, get our lens. I'm not going to take the ends off yet because we'll, you'll see that later. Oh, um, Morgan, Ooh. this thing is heavy. <laughs> is, is your camera, is just the tripod even going to be able to hold it up? Oh, yeah. Right, hang on, let's, hang on. So that's the, oh Dude, my god. This, it's so <laughs> smooth. I've never had such a smooth, okay. So here, let's get you a little bit of focus. We've got our uh, f-stop and like zoom and stuff. That's amazing. In fact, I'm going to put the lens hood on it like right away. Is that possible? Can I do that? I'm just gonna do a test. You may have to take the uh, lens caps off. This like bit goes on the end, look. So is there like a yeah? It looks like a certain way you can put it on. There we go. So there's our. Oh wow. That is a sick lens. Okay, so right. There we go. So it clicks Ooh. on, and then we've got that there. I like these cool bags because uh, I have stuff to store stuff in when I'm. We're possibly going to go to some trade shows at some point. Not sure. So that's going to be useful. And now, the daddy. <laughs> that, that look at the camera. That look. Like <laughs> the GH4. It opens from the bottom. That's how, it's so good. It just starts at the bottom. So let's do Started this. from the bottom. Now we're um, here. Guys, so many YouTubers use this. Uh, Unbox Therapy uses this. Uh, Linus Tech Tips used to use it for its B-roll before they got the A7S Mark II. Love you, Brandon, by the way, mate. You you like reply to all my Instagram uh, things. Got our Lumix. Um, I guess this is a disc of software. Silky Picks. Never going to use that in my life, but I guess you've got it. 
Um, if you're buying this for its photo capabilities, um, I'm sorry, you might be a bit out of luck because it's not particularly good at photos compared to like your Canons and, and stuff. It's about equivalent to my camera, which I got right here, which is like a quarter of the price. But uh, if you're using this for its video capabilities, congratulations, you picked basically the best 4K camera for the money. Um, if you look online, pretty much every 4K video has either been shot on a GH4 or an FS7. Um, and obviously there are others, but like they're the most common ones. Um, so let's just undo this. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. You, gotta, you gotta do the sniff. You gotta do the new camera sniff. Oh, see, oh, you see that. Just... Smells of 4K. <laughs> We're gonna get to that, but we got our Lumix strap, our GH4 and then Lumix strap. Probably gonna have to put that on there just for legal reasons. If I drop this, my life is over. Uh, what the fuck? Again. What? What is it with there's that? There's another one of these weird plugs. Um, yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. I'm not sure that... Oh, the battery's way more substantial than oh, the wow. uh, G7X. So, it's very similar. In fact, it's a bit bigger in size um, to my uh, 600D battery. So, it kind of looks like this. Uh, which is a bit weird, but, you know, it's whatever. We get a USB. Yeah, that's a micro USB, not a mini USB. Thank you, Panasonic. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, mini's a good standard, but I like micro just because it's so ubiquitous. That's not micro USB, that's a complete lie. This is some kind of weird either proprietary or like messed up connector. So, cool. Thanks Panasonic. Proprietary connectors, love that. Um, that's a weird USB cable. I, I'm not guessing it's that long. And then finally, apart from the camera, we have the battery charger, which is much more um, alike to my 600D yeah. in terms of its size. So I, in a second, I'll show you all the camera batteries we've got kind of lined up there. Um, and I'm guessing that uses figure eight. Yes, it does use figure eight, just like the rest of them. So it's standard stuff. Um, in here, you get nothing else apart from the, the camera. main man. Oh, I'm just gonna check in case we do have something else. That camera um, comes in a little plastic bit. Oh, oh. Oh. It's the new it's the new camera smell. It's, it's the getting new camera to me. smell. It's just setting stuff off. It's like set me up. From across town. From across town. It's across town you can smell it. So let's put that back in there. So guys, if you don't know about this camera's capabilities or you've never heard of it, it does shoot 4K video at 30 FPS or at least 25 FPS. Pretty sure it's 30 FPS. Um, it's micro four thirds, which is a, a cool standard that is, is quite common. Um, although it's starting to fade away and here it is so oh, oh, if oh, I feel oh. that there's some rattly oh, okay it's just the little bits on the side <laughs> there you go no, there's nothing that feels a lot like it's like a soft touch on the like grip and then there's like it's all metal um, this feels a lot like a, a kind of a, a 600D that's been a bit squidged on the top that's what I'd that's what I'd call it. The the button for the record seems a bit mushy. Um, and there's di there's a dial here. Are you, ready? Are you ready, Morgan? There's a dial. Yeah. Okay. That's much easier to do in my 600D. There's a dial here. That's like a soft one. That's a silent one. Then there's a dial here. <coughs> Bless it. Morgan has got allergies from this stuff, man. It's crazy. Allergies. Um, it's getting to the start of summer and I'm just hay fever, man. It's just, yeah. Even so, though this is like night time. Right, I don't know if you can see out the window there, but yeah. It's night. Um, it's so we've got our, our spring-loaded SD card door. Loving that. Nice. Um, we've got our mic uh, port, which we will be using our Rode mic on. We've got the screen, which is a flip-out. Almost is exactly like the 600D, apart from this is a touchscreen, I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure it's a touchscreen. Uh, comes with your standard mount. You've got a cool little locking mechanism for the battery. Um, bank, and we're gonna see actually. <laughs> Bless you, Morgan. Oh my god. Jesus, we're gonna look. Where did I put the battery to? Did I put it? There it is. So we're gonna see if this thing has any juice in a second. Uh, let me just take the whatever that is out. Um, and we'll do a test. <laughs> oh Bless you, Morgan. <laughs> I'm gonna have to mute my mic in a bit. Um, so now it's fine. So we've got our GH4 here. Battery's run out on the camera, ironically. 
All right, so we've uh, we've just changed the battery in this camera. Uh, I'm slightly moved over now, so I'm over this side. I've just moved it on the slide. Let me just move that stuff back there. So it's not quite as smooth as, you know, if you just use it because I'm an idiot. Um, so we've got the GH4. Sigma. Both speed booster, we're putting them all together, boys. So first things first, I need to be as careful as I can with all this equipment. Oh, I need some kind of mask, man. Okay, all right. So first, you guys can just about see this. Let me zoom you in down there. We're going to put it all together right now. You guys should be able to see that. I'm just going to bump up the ISO just because when I'm zoomed in, it looks different. So here we go. we got our Metamone Speed Booster, which just comes off. Oh, my God, that is... Okay, phew. That is in there. I'm trying not to breathe, by the way, so I don't like get stuff on the camera. Let me just focus. Okay, just so I don't get any like thing in the mount. So that is already like taller. If you can't see that, it's actually taller now. Um, so that's not going to go on a tripod unless you mount it from here, which is what I was expecting. Um, and now I'm going to I'm going to stop breathing again, guys, just so that I can. Okay, you ready? <laughs> oh my god that looks ridiculous what is going <laughs> on guys okay let's zoom out and then change the iso again i, I need to one i put it on auto iso there we go it's on auto now so you guys should be able to see that this oh Oh that God. is so heavy. You have no <laughs> idea. Like, Morgan, that is so heavy. Oh. Gee, so we've now got our Metabones caps, which I wonder if they can just... No, no. So that goes in there. I'll put those in there. I'm also going to put, put all caps. the lens caps in there. Hey? Yo, I was just going to suggest that you put all the lens caps in there. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah I'm going to do that. So. You've still got one on the end of your uh, Sigma. Oh, yeah, that, that's going to stay with it, so... If we leave that there, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna have to do something else because that doesn't all fit in there. That is so heavy. Um, so this is basically our new setup. It's gonna look like that. If we take the, uh, are you ready? Oh, oh it's my gosh. green. Let's turn this baby on. It has juice. Oh, nice. How much? Okay, it doesn't say. Okay, right. We're gonna do the time again. What's the time, Morgan? In fact, no. I'll do uh, the date first whilst you do okay. that. Okay. Okay, it's the 18th. Right, it's the 18th, yeah? Of March, yeah. Yeah. I mean, well, it's not when you're watching this. No, but... 2016. Yeah. Okay, what's the time? It is 21.13 at the minute, so round up to 21.14. 21.14. Okay. There we go. Oh. Morgan. Is it crispy? There is so much bokeh. Oh, oh my god, Morgan, it's like naught point. Oh, the battery's almost running out, but... Oh, wow. Wait, is this autofocus now? So if I... All right, guys, so we've had the stuff for over a week now. I cut out the rest of the footage because, as you can tell from the length of this, this is actually just ridiculous. So uh, I hope you've enjoyed the little unboxing series, but this is the end to it. I know I crammed it all into one week just because I know you guys didn't really want to see it that much, and we can return to our normal vid scheduled videos Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays of ownings and unboxing. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this little video. I, I'll just put some kind of thumbnail over the top of this. Um, but, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see you next time. Peace.